plants and soil That's the only bit of toil The seeds you keep Those ones you will never reap Get out to make hay Keep the pride and heat away That's the only That's the only way to go Am I lying? Did he not rape me? Coco, what has come over you? What is it? Come over me. Really, come over me. Do you want the boy to hear about this? The boy. His name is not the boy. His name is Tete. And what? And what, Coco? Huh? You know what? I need some air. You can't keep running away like this forever. What is it about the boy at all that you are keeping him a secret? He's not the first to be crippled or have a single mother. What is it? This is not about the boy. This is about the fact that your husband, my own father, defiled me. What would I have done? What? Who is, Who is it? it? It's me, Kofi. Cox. Kofi, I said I would call you. See, I was tired of waiting. And by the way, what was happening there? Cops, it's me. Don't walk away. What's happening? Kofi, I'm tired. I'm just tired. What is it again? I just wanted to tell you that... I don't want to hear it. But it's about our daughter, Efwa. It's always about Efwa. Well, whether you want to hear it or not, she needs a new... There is no money for that. But you know without it, she cannot see anything. There is no money for it. What do you want me to do? Tell me. Your daughter has finished all the money we have, all in the name of being blind. My daughter. Your daughter. My daughter. I am tired. I really am. But she's your daughter too. I mean, for crying, why are you acting as if you're the only one going through this? I mean, come on, look at me. I'm only 26 years old, and my mates are living their lives to the fullest. For crying out loud, I don't even remember the last time I had a makeover. I don't even know what a manicure or a pedicure or even a massage feels like anymore. So don't you just sit there and tell me that you don't have any money and say that she's my daughter, like she's not a burden to me. For crying out loud, I did not make, make her blind. Me. I didn't make her blind, I didn't. What is wrong with you? I want a divorce. What? I want a divorce. I'm 
fed up. Fine. So what are you going to do about it for? I don't know. I mean, I can't even take care of her even if I wanted to. But you're the one who has been taking care of her. That's because you've been giving us money. Or do you still plan to give us money after the divorce? Well, that's the main reason why I wanted a divorce. We want a divorce because you can't afford to take care of Ifwa and I. Well, I can't afford to take care of her either. So what's going to happen to her then? Who cares? Wait. I chanced on this lady on TV. I've forgotten her name, Christ's sake. Um, what? Uh, I... Coco, Coco Kofi. Yeah. What does she do? Uh, I think she's an advocate whatsoever for kids. The name, Coco, Coco something. Coco Kofi, yeah, I'm sure it's Coco Kofi. I think I really we need to look for her. Coco Kofi. Maybe she could help us. We need to look for her. Yeah, she could help us. Oh, Ilo. <laughs> You're welcome. Well, we are traveling. She will call you when we get to where we are going. Won't you say anything, Kofi? I'm leaving you all. Come in. I called you a million times yesterday. You did? I sent over 40 messages too. To my phone? You sure you have the right number? I'm sorry, Julie. For what exactly? For standing me up and making me look stupid? Or for ignoring me like nothing happened? For everything. I just didn't know how to, to face you after standing you up. I was scared you will... Scared I will... You just don't get it. It's beyond being sorry. We were talking to about 30 minutes too. And you just... You just became an ass. You stopped picking my calls and replying my messages. And I was scared, thinking something happened to you. But then I see you in the morning looking all fine and healthy. So Kobe, like, this sorry thing isn't going to cut it. I understand, but what do you want me to say? What the hell were you? What happened? It's Coco. What happened to her? You know how she is. She asked me to help her do some serious work. And I couldn't use my phone. When we were done, it was too late to call. And I got scared. Serious work? Coco has you doing serious work for her? Oh, Kobe. What do you mean by that? A male cleaner and around boy isn't smart enough to help a brilliant activist do anything? Wow. That's where you placed me? I, I didn't mean it that way. I... It's, it's just... It's just unlike... Unlike her... To need anything from someone like me. I'm sorry. I didn't mean it that way. I, 
was just sad we didn't have our night together. I was looking forward to it. I was too. It was just work. I'll make it up to you, I promise, okay? Thank you so much. Coco? Coco? About yesterday, can we talk? Please, I, I just don't want... Please, Coco, please. Look, I'm late for work. Maybe when I come back. You're on TV. You're in the news. Welcome to Youth Bridge TV with Ohima Setre. Now in other news, the Minister for Gender, Children and Social Protection, Mrs. A.F. Aku, two days ago, visited the highly respected Ms. Koko Kofi at her office to commend her for the amazing work she does with children, the youth and persons with disability in the country. In addition, she presented a car to Ms. Kofi and praised her team for the sacrifices they make. She said, we are very proud of the work Ms. Kofi does and we wish her and her team all the best. Will you get back to work? Tutu, hey, I told you, do not creep up on me. Uh, I just wanted to check on you. Off. What's the issue? Is work stressing you out? You've been moody the past few days. Work is always stressful, I'm fine. No, you are not. Hey. See who is having man power plans. I can't believe it. Tell me, tell me. There's not much to tell. It's just yes. that he moved in. Mm -hmm. Not like he fully moved in, but we've grown fond of each other in recent times and he hangs around a lot, so mm -hmm. I can't send him back. Mm -hmm. So he stays. It's... It's like we're married or something. It's just that... Why am I even telling you this? Get back to work. You seem happy, but you don't look happy. Didi, I said get back to work. I am not going anywhere until you tell me this one. Uh... See, Didi, I've been in a lot of relationships, but I've had a bad history with men. I'm not always lucky with them, but I feel vulnerable with Never mind. Who is he? I want to know who that is. Pretty please. Leave me alone. Just stop asking me stupid questions. Okay. Sorry. So what are you going to do? What else can I do? Nothing. I'll be fine. You know, these things work themselves out. I'll be fine, cause I'm sure you'll be fine. Besides, you're a strong man. 
sharp. Strong man, oh. fine man, yeah. muscle. <laughs> Can't I gas up my best friend? Are you blushing? <laughs> hey, coffee so you can blush. Oh, Jaisa. <laughs> I'm so sorry to interrupt, Coco. You really need to take this case. Well, then I guess that's my exit. No, 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 no. Stay. I mean, so you can see what it is that I do here. Are you sure? But you have to promise not to talk. Alright, alright. What am I even gonna do home? Let me just stay. Exactly. Please bring the name. Is he always like this in your office? Trust me, this is actually a slow day. That's why you're here like this. Charlie, you're doing well though. I'm trying. I can't, I can't just be under pressure like this, even with the one I have in my house. How may I help you? We want a divorce. Um, I'm sorry. I'm not a divorce lawyer. Neither am I a marriage counselor. So, how may I help um, you? This is our daughter, Eva. Are you in the middle of a custody battle? I mean, even if you are, it's still not what we do here. There's no battle for custody. We both do not want him. Um, to Icy, please take the girl out and get her something to um, eat or drink. Okay. Repeat what you just said. It's not a big deal. We want to get a divorce. We can't work. And I don't want to be with this burden. Besides, my wife feels the same way too. I know it seems like we're wicked people, but you wouldn't understand. Taking care of her is so hard. And we're beginning to lose ourselves. At least I am. <laughs> We don't mean to be wicked, and she's just a little girl, and that's why we're here. I don't know if you could help her find a family. Hey, help me understand this. You want to get rid of your daughter. Yes. Why? Her blindness is causing too much, and we don't have too much money. See, we're young, we can still have full lives. There is no need for this stress. I, I don't think I've ever heard of anything quite like this. But then again, I so you'll be able to help her find foster family? Have you two really thought about it? I mean, do you understand that when you lose that child, you can never have her back? It will be legally binding. We're sure. All right? Yeah. Are you both mad? What the hell is wrong with the two of you? See, you are gifted the Buddhist child. And because what? She's blind, you want to throw her away? Come on, this is nonsense. How, how can you just do that? You are so heartless, you are going to regret this. Kofi! Kofi, please. Sir, you don't understand. I can barely take care of our feeding. And having a foie makes everything a lot worse. Well, you work hard, my brother, you work harder. Do you know the number of people who want what you have? You just don't have any idea. Who can you even do this? I mean, technically, yes, they can. Well, then I'll take her. Kofi. Come on, Cox, I'll take her. Kofi. I'll take her. Uh, 
Please, can you just give us a few moments? No problem. I just want to say, we trust your judgment, madam. If you find a suitable family, whether it's this man here or someone you can trust, we'll be very grateful. Yeah, just give me, a, give me a moment. Thank you. What was that? Cox. No, what's wrong with Cox, you? I listen, told you to keep Cox, quiet. Listen, Cox. See, this girl is so precious. Do you understand? The girl is so precious. And I just don't understand these wicked people. How can they just be so hard? Coco, just, just do this, please. Listen, it is their child. Right? I may not agree with this entirely, but it's their child. I can't do anything Coco, about you this. You can do something, Coco. Please, you can do something. That is why you are Coco. See? Just give this girl just one chance. Okay, just give me the chance. If not a girl, just give me the chance. Let me change this girl's life into a better one. You know how Isi and I are struggling. You know what we've been going through. Coffee. You know what we've been going through. I tell you all the time, girls. Please do this. This girl is so precious. Please do this. Let this happen, Coco. Please. I can feel it. She's so precious. 